All right, what we're doing here today is uh, we have a 996 set of heads that we're installing beryllium seats in, and we're going to use stainless steel valves. They're going to be oversized valves. And what you can see here is I've already bored one seat pocket out. You can see that this one, the shiny surface on it, has been recently bored, and this is the one we're about to bore for the correct press fit for the beryllium seats. Here's the seat. Beryllium copper is a very good heat sink. It'll pull heat off the valve very effectively, so that's why it's a good material to use for this type of application for high performance. So let's cut this thing. So basically what I have to do is over bore the seat so that it's a larger diameter but it's a press fit so I get the seats custom made to the right dimension that I'm boring this to so that whenever you press the seat into the head that it doesn't fall out whenever the head's heated from natural running of, you know, on the track or street or dyno. And without the right press fit, press fit the seats will fall out of the heads. See how multi-talented I am here as holding the camera and running the machine at the same time. <laughs> now, I've already preset the cutter diameter to make the right cut diameter and the depth. I'm actually watching a depth gauge that you can't see right now so to make sure that I don't go too deep into the head because there's a certain depth I want it and I'll actually increase the depth by a certain amount because the more of a thicker seat that you can put in the head, the bigger of a heat sink it acts as and the better, more effective as it is pulling heat off of the, the valve. And on the exhaust, the exhaust valves, we want the valve to run as cool as possible. And let's see, we're just about now, we're down into the, the head. Be going deeper. see the freshly board seat pockets and we'll finish up the intake side and we will at that point press the seats into the heads and then we'll go back set the head back up in the machine and recut the valve seat faces for the ceiling surfaces of the valves that little guy is going to fit right in there in his chest it won't fit right now, but once I heat that head up to a certain temperature and uh, ice the seats on uh, dry ice for a little while, and that seat will fall straight in there, and once it cools down, it'll, it'll never come out until it's bored out again. <laughs> 